Alright folks, it is time once again for another Latchkey Food Review. And today we are returning to Jersey Mike's. Because there is a sub there that has captured my interest as of late. One that I have not tried yet. I mean, there's a lot of them I have not tried from uh, Jersey Mike's. But I am making my way through their menu. One sub at a time. You know, in between all the other reviews that I do. But today, I think we're going to go check out that uh, Jersey Mike's chicken cheesesteak. I think that is what it's called. Uh, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called there. Chicken cheesesteak. Now, <laughs> oh, I've never heard chicken be called steak before, so this is kind of interesting. But, you know, I think it uh, <laughs> is more or less a, a, a grilled chicken melt. Uh, type of situation. I'm not sure. Uh, if they want to call it a chicken cheese steak, I'm cool with that. I mean, some people like to get technical over things such as that. I, I, not me. You know, chicken cheese steak. If that's what you want to call it. That's fine. Let's go get us one of them. There, Jersey Mike's chicken cheese steak subs. All right, folks. We are uh, passing the Jersey Mike's now. We're fixing to find us a place to uh, park here. Uh, parking's tight. Parking is tight. See, uh, this uh, Jersey Mike's is located <clears throat> in a little mini mall type of place with a big grocery store in front of that. So. Makes it a little hard to get into. All right, we're going to go get that chicken cheese steak, and we're going to bring it back out here, and we're going to give it a good old review coming right up. All right, folks, so I got it. And I got the big bad boy this time, the large. First time I've ever got a large from Jersey Mike's. And I went to uh, Firehouse the other day, and I got their large, which is kind of similar to this size. Eh, maybe not quite this big. This is a big old bad boy here. But that and this 20 ounce drink eat up a $20 bill. <laughs> $20.60 to be exact. Now, I was wrong. Well, I'll admit when I'm wrong. This is not called a cheesesteak. This is simply just called a chicken filly. And uh, I was going to try to pick up both sides at one time, but uh, opted against it. There you go. That is a chicken Philly sub from Jersey Mike's. It's going to be a messy one. So it is prepared the way a Philly cheesesteak is prepared. Just with chicken. Instead of steak. Now they brought out a big old frozen slab of chicken. Kind of looks the way steak them looks you know if you ever buy steak them in the store except for it was uh, a sheet of chicken and they chop that thing up on a blackstone grill top peppers and onions um, melted American cheese on there as well. Mm. 
Mm. You got to be careful with this one. This one will come open on you. <laughs> and, uh, I'm not going to be able to eat both halves of these right away. That's a lot of sandwich. Just a chicken filly. Nothing too special. Try to open it a little bit. So you can see, there you go. A little bit of peppers and onions in there. Chicken Philly, who'd have thought? Who would have thought? Don't get me wrong, it is good. It is real good. That is especially good hot. Fresh off the Blackstone Grill, that chicken. That chicken, pepper, and onion is. All right, folks, we're going to hit the uh, <clears throat> road like we always do. We're going to talk about it in the afterthoughts coming up next. All right, folks, so my final afterthoughts on uh, Jersey Mike's Chicken Philly. Uh, what can I say? It is definitely a two thumbs up item. For sure. I mean, it's very good, very tasty. Now, I feel like when it comes to Jersey Mike's, when they're cooking stuff on their little uh, Blackstone grill, uh, like their cheesesteak and their and their uh, chicken uh, Philly here, uh, I think it puts that stuff more on the level of a short order cook. Uh, situation than it does than it does you know uh, uh like a like a deli style you know sub like like subway and like some of jersey mike's subs are definitely deli style for sure uh but when you come to the ones that are cooked on that blackstone uh that's more short order cooked type of uh food in that situation uh it is very good. It is very delicious. It's but it's on a different level than uh, it, it's, 
you can't really compare it <laughs> to anything else you get in a deli uh, because of that reason. Uh, it's on a level all by itself. So, uh, you know, people who's always compare, you know, other cheesesteak subs, you know, who have the ready-made deli steak already there, uh, cold, ready to heat up, you know, to, to serve as a sandwich, you know, deli style. Uh, compared to something frozen that you take out, you heat it on the grill, you chop it up, I mean, uh, that's, you're dealing with raw meat, you know, fresh, you know, it's just hard to uh, compare the two. Uh, I'm not sure how the rest of them prepare. There's, I know they got a rotis rotisserie chicken that they use at uh, Subway. I guess, you know, it would be kind of considered the closest thing to this that they would have. But uh, basically, you know, all your Italian and some of your pizza shops and stuff that do subs on the side, you know, your mom and pops, all serve this type of chicken sub and actually you know some of theirs are on a next level up because they're using fresh chicken you can tell as opposed to that frozen sheet of chicken that uh jersey mike's has now it's good now, i do give it two thumbs up like i said i am not knocking it in any way but uh it is uniquely jersey mike's and jersey mike's alone that's all i can say about it it is good go give it a try for yourself if you don't believe me Tell them Latchkey sent you. If they don't know what that means, I apologize in advance. <laughs> all right, folks, that's all I have for this review. So until the next time, you folks have a good one.